In this video we will be talking about the states of matter. Matter is defined as anything that takes up space. The states of matter are the distinct forms in which matter can exist. The four main states of matter are solid, liquid, gas and plasma. There are many others, but they do not generally exist every day in the natural world. We will also talk about how matter can change states. A solid is when molecules are packed together in a rigid structure. Solids have a definite volume. They are resistant to force on its surface. For example you can push your finger into a pool of water, but you can't push your finger through a table. There are two kinds of solids, crystalline and amorphous. In crystalline solids the particles are arranged in a repeated, symmetrical pattern, for example, salt, rocks and metals. Amorphous solids have no form and their pattern of molecules is asymmetrical. They tend to be more flexible. They have no definite melting point, instead they melt gradually over a range of temperatures. Examples include rubber, gels and most plastics. Liquid is a state of matter that is between solid and gas. The molecules are loosely connected and they can flow freely around each other. A liquid has no fixed shape, but will take up the shape of its container, while retaining its own volume. Viscosity is a property of liquids. It means how resistant it is to flowing freely. High viscosity liquids, such as honey, will trickle slowly and stick to surfaces. Low viscosity liquids, such as water, will slide quickly off most surfaces. Gas is a state of matter that has no fixed shape or volume. The molecules in a gas are very spread out. The molecules will diffuse to fill its container. The smaller the container, the more compact the gas, the higher the pressure. Heating gases causes them to expand. Examples of gases include oxygen, carbon dioxide and methane. Plasma, like a gas, has no fixed shape or volume. It is made up of atoms with little to no electrons, as well as free-flowing ions. Plasmas can conduct electricity, and they can be held in place by magnetic fields. Because they can conduct electricity, the particles are able to interact with each other at much greater distance than in gases. Noble gases are often ionized into plasma, such as in neon signs or plasma balls. Plasma is the most common state of matter in the universe. Examples of where plasma can be found are places such as stars, fire and lightning. Changing states is adding or removing energy from a substance until it becomes a different state of matter. The main ones you would hear about are melting, freezing, vaporization and condensation. There are also a few other ways for matter to change states, such as sublimation, which is when a solid turns directly into a gas. An example of this is dry ice, which is a solid that turns to gas at room temperature. There is also deposition, which is when a gas turns directly into a solid. An example of this is when frost forms on a glass window. The last one is ionization, which is when you send an electric current through a gas and it turns into a plasma. There is also a certain level of temperature and pressure where all three states of a substance can exist at the same time. This is called the triple point. Thank you for watching our video.